Once upon a time, his name was uh, Sanjay Controversy Dutt. That, of course, has changed. Let's take you back in time for just a moment to check out life that has been what they call riddled with controversy. The muscular, droopy eyed screen hero found it difficult to handle the pressures of being the son of one of India's superstar couples. A former drug addict, he's led a troubled and well publicized private life. But his fans have stood by him. आज हम इसलिए करते हैं कि आज हम संजय दत्त भाई है जो हमारा उसके लिए हम प्रेयर करना चाहते हैं संजय दत्त के लिए हम इसलिए इकट्ठे हुए हैं क्योंकि वो हमारे गांव का है उन्होंने हमारे गांव के लिए उनकी डैडी ने बहुत कुछ किया है और अभी इसलिए हम उनके लिए प्रेयर कर रहे हैं कि जो उनके ऊपर केस आया है वो हट जाए भाई संजय के लिए आज तेरे आगे अर्ज है प्रभु उस भाई पे अपने दया कर तो दया सागर है तो दया करने वाला है His problem started early in life as he is known to have taken to drugs while still in high school. When his mother died shortly before the release of his first film Rocky in 1981, his addiction worsened. Dutt returned to films after a stint at a rehabilitation center in the United States where he met his future wife Richa Sharma who later succumbed to brain tumor in 1997. Three weeks before the release of his film Kalnayak, Sanjay Dutt was jailed for six years for possessing illegal weapons acquired from terrorists linked to the 1993 bombings in Mumbai. In 2001, he was investigated for alleged money laundering deals between the Mumbai underworld and Bollywood. In 2007, Dutt was sentenced to six years rigorous imprisonment for illegally possessing weapons. At the same time, he was also cleared of terrorism conspiracy charges in the blast related to the 1993 bombing. Sanjay Dutt retains popular support and sympathy from Bollywood as most see him as a sober, good-hearted man whose troubles and youth refuses to leave him. The actor, known as Deadly Dutt for his macho image and portrayal of gangsters and the anti-hero, has truly been controversy's favorite child. Garima Purana headlines today. Personally, my heart goes out to the Dutt family. Well, all extensions, of course, because he has had a colorful life. And yes, his name is Anju Baba. If it's well on his shoulders. Sanjay Dutt's tumultuous times began with his mum Nargis's death. He had to battle with a drug problem early in his life. Solace and support came in the form of his first wife, Richa Sharma, who passed away of cancer in 1996. Sanjay was involved in a bitter courtroom battle with his in-laws over the custody of his only child Trishula. But la found him again. Sanjay met model Riya Pillai through friends a year later in 1997. While the love story was straight out of a Bollywood film Sanjay proposed to her on Valentine's Day when they were partying together. Wasting no time, they headed straight to the temple and tied the knot. But marital bliss evaded Sanjay this time as well. Reportedly, Riya found it difficult to cope with Sanjay's regular jail visits, and soon reality caught up with the lovers. Separated in 2005, Ria moved on to be Mrs Leander Pace. And then Sanjay met Manyata or Dilnawaz Sheikh in 2007. After dating for a short while, Sanjay decided to take the plunge for a third time. Standing by her man when he was in the Yerwada jail and looking after his health 
finances and career. Manita has been a good influence on Dutt. While this marriage has had its ups and downs with controversies about Manita's past, but those are just skeletons in the closet like Sanju's own. And now with the arrival of the cute and cuddly twins, who look like a splitting image of Sanjay himself, looks like Sanjay has finally found his anger. Entertainment Bureau Headlines Today